Let's just say full face of makeup and I feel like there's nothing there. That's goals. Hey guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl cheche <laughs> so today guys i'm just going to be like doing like um, a quick makeup tutorial and so i found this um if you live in australia you know how difficult it is you know to walk into the shopping malls like um woolies and coals and then get like a dark skin product honestly like you have to actually go to sephora to get this thing so most times almost everything is on my channel I honestly order it from the actual company's website and then most of these companies are not like in Australia so it takes like weeks to get to me dig it but yeah so I found the store on Instagram and um, it's called dark elegance okay so this video is not sponsored yeah the products were gifted but it is certainly not sponsored but I found I found it though and I was really really impressed because they get to send you like they, they sell makeup products from like brands that you know you guys have been seen in this video and they just get to deliver to you amazing right like i don't have to go to woolies trying to find like a foundation that is dark enough for my skin okay <laughs> so, yeah, so i'm going to leave their link in the description box and um, you guys can head over to the website and order yourself makeup products that will suit your skin tone okay so the first thing i'm going to do is my brows and i got these brows from them this is the la girl shady slim brown pencil in blackest brown okay it comes with a spoolie and then it comes with a brow a brow pencil and honestly i love brow pencils like this thing it's like so thin yeah it's always easy and it's more like gives me more control and gives me that precise small not thick not dark brown eyebrows okay <laughs> okay it's been a very long while since i've filmed the youtube video so you guys should just bear with me as i go through this struggle again all right i feel like i'm filming my first video as you guys already know i have like two detailed eyebrow tutorials on my channel and they're doing pretty well okay guys so now that my brows are done let me just say something okay so when i was ordering this right i have like trust issues when i'm ordering things online and coming to this place like when you order something that's called brown or like tan or like dark brown it's not always brown okay so i ordered blackest brown because of course i have trust issues <laughs> but oh my god this is so dark now i'm wishing i would have a shade lighter than this because i don't really like fancy my brows like really dark but this la girl slim shade shady slim brown pencil in blackest brown is blackest brown literally blackest brown so yeah my brows are slayed okay so I'm going to go ahead and prime my face off camera and then we'll come back for the foundation, okay? Okay guys, so moving on to the, moving on to my concealer, I'm going to use this and this is the NYX Cream Highlight and Contour Palette in the shade Deep, yeah, just deep, okay? So this is, this is it, this is the concealer, this is the contour and this is the highlight. So I also got this from there, like... This is the shade. Let me just turn down my light so you guys can see this this shade very very well. <laughs> okay, so with my light turned down, do you see how dark this is? This is so amazing. Like this is like so freaking dark, man. Like so dark. This is like I think this is this should be like the darkest cream contour that I have right now in my collection. So I'm just going to go ahead and take this and highlight my face okay and this is like my skin shade actually not those days you want to do spot conceal we found with concealer is like your shade and you don't want to like use foundation this is perfect but you know what i'm going to do i'm going to use the foundation because it's your time to shine i mean it's bright enough so like i'm going i'm going to use and highlight my face yeah guys where this thing blends into my skin like that you see this like it blends into my skin this foundation that i use as concealer is so good like 
I just wonder why I've never used Black Radiance, any Black Radiance product before. Like, this is so freaking good. Like, it just blends and it's matte. So, if you like have oily skin like me, this is like really amazing. Like, really, really amazing because it dries down matte. It looks like I've already like like set my on the eye, but I've not. It's just the concealer. It's just the foundation toned concealer. <laughs> now, I'm going to go ahead and contour my face with the contour here. And this is like a cream highlight and I think I already have I have just one cream highlight so I'm gonna use this I'm going to use this now before I set my face because I don't know how it feels like to add a cream product on a powdered face so I'm going to go ahead and apply the contour and apply the cream highlights like this is so dark and these are matte as well because it's creamy yeah but it's matte like it's not shiny like i have to like actually pick up like products like oh my god you guys see this so i'm looking at my face i don't think i have makeup on i'm actually like okay with this coverage and how light and how blended in every single thing is okay right, so like i said i'm going to go ahead and use the highlights and highlights under my powder so it's be like glow from within when i eventually apply powder on my face okay but this is oh my god <gasps> this is so freaking pigmented they're like nyx oh my god <laughs> this is so freaking pigmented okay so i didn't want to apply too much because i might still go ahead and use like a powder highlight at the end of the day so i'm going to set my face and i have this powder that i got from them and this is the iman this is the iman second to non semi loose powder in the shade earth dark okay so let me just tell you guys when i was ordering from the website okay i ordered everything dark because i have everything light and i needed things like this to like um use on days i don't want to actually do makeup makeup and not be too bright if that makes sense okay i did an unboxing video right of all these products so if you're not following me on instagram i'm going to leave my link yeah in the description box actually i'm going to leave my link in the description box i'm going to leave my name here for you guys to follow me on instagram but for you to bring out the product you just have to like twist and twist and twist so because of the unboxing i did i already have like products in here so i'm not going to set my face with this i'm going to use this as an all over face powder because i need to like brighten my on the eye because everything looks like i don't even have makeup on my face perfect skin color and i think i have a little bit of coverage because i actually added like a little bit of coverage on this cheekbone so here we have it my favorite part of this whole video honestly is the eyeshadow palette this is from Root Cosmetics and this is their City of Neon Lights. Okay, so this is it. And this is what it looks like. It looks like a book. So I just opened a book. This palette, it's so beautiful. Okay guys, so we're just going to play around with this palette. I have no idea what I'm going to do. I didn't even think about it. I was just super excited. Okay, so I swatched this on my Instagram. Like I said, I'm going to do my Instagram here. For you guys to go follow me so if you want to see like the swatches they're on instagram and i can tell you this is these are so so like the matte the shimmer shades are like so freaking so like it just it was just melting into my hands like melting into, it was so soft and the matte shade as well matte pigmented and it has um 15 matte shades and nine shimmer shades okay, so first i'm going to go in with this shade and this is shade called lovely tones this shade so i'm just going to pack this shade in the outer corner of my eyes with a small stippling brush okay this is what it looks like and this brush is from jessel and this is their lux pencil brush so i'm just going to pack this shade here okay i've not done something like this before so yeah here we have it I want to zoom you guys in a little bit more so you can see everything that I'm doing. Alright, 
So I'm still building up this shade to make it like really dark enough the way I want. And there are, there are fallouts, but like little to none. This is like a matte shade. Of course, there's going to be fallouts, but barely. You guys can see there's barely any fallout. Now, as a transition shade, I'm going to go ahead and use this pink, and this is called Pigment Perfect. Yeah, this pink. I'm going to use this and blend out this. Honestly, I'm the last person you should ask about colors. I just don't know what they are called. Okay, I'm going to use and blend out this that looks like purple. Actually, it's light purple. Yeah. And pink is always perfect transitions for purple. So, here we are. I'm going to cut my crease with this P. Louise base in the shade Rumor Zero. I want to just shake up this eyeshadow look. Okay. I'm actually considering using this. This is like a bright yellow. And using this, this is like a lemon green. I'm going to pack this on my cut crease area. I'm going to do a wing liner, but I'm going to use my eyeshadow palette and just recreate this color in reverse. I mean, actually, I saw it on an influencer's face, okay, and I've been thinking about it, and I feel like I need to do it. And like, I, I, I just, I admire the, like, you guys will know Ohima Bon, so she's like the queen of colorful eyeshadow. Like, ain't there any inspiration for like eyeshadow, colorful eyeshadow looks? Just, I just go to her page. So I'm going to use like an angled brush, and I'm just going to pick up the concealer. This is still the P. Louise base concealer, okay? So I'm going to pick up the concealer. And you know, do your normal wing liner. So, for the inner corner of my eyes, the purple, I'm going to use like a small brush. Okay, this small brush. And I'm going to apply this pink inside my eyes, just like do a reverse of what i use on my eyes the pink the purple and the yellow okay so this is it with the lashes oh that's what i had to like do my lips and the last thing that i have from the store the dark elegant store is this glittering shimmer natural glow <laughs> and this is from oakland beauty okay guys this is so freaking beautiful like i have to reduce my life for you guys to see this palette really well this is like amazing so here it has the bronze side it's all shimmer though but here it has like the bronze side and here it has like the pinkish and i forgot to show you guys one more i also have this okay also it's also from the store and this is a Karate Cosmetic Bomb Blush, Blush Bomb, okay. So this is what it looks like inside, okay. This is like, this is like, um, these two are blush and this is a shimmer. This is like a highlight, yeah. I really don't have this shade of blush in any of my collection. I'm like, I'm, I'm really happy because it's so pigmented, like, hey guys see this? This is like pigment. <laughs> and I'm just going to blush my cheeks, ooh. Yes, girl. Mm -hmm. This is what I'm talking about. This is so pigmented. Like, I'm actually being very light handed so I don't get to like over blush myself. <laughs> so, I'm not going to use the highlight in this palette just because I want to use the highlight in this one that I showed you guys initially. So, I'm going to go ahead and use the top part. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and mix this two well everything i want a touch of everything on my cheekbone i'm such a weird person but here we i think a touch of everything is everything oh my god can you guys i'm sure you guys can see this there's no points i am going to be blinding people today <laughs> okay this is actually really beautiful and so pigmented and if i just making me glow 
is amazing okay guys so yeah this is the final look uh, i'm going to reduce my lights more so you guys can see like how popping this eyeshadow looks like okay guys so i reduced my light so you guys can see how this eyeshadow looks like this is like so amazing you see this is so vibrant this is the final look i hope you enjoyed watching this video and also don't forget i'm going to leave the link to the store in the description box so if you need if you're having issues trying to find a place to get like a dark shade i not eyeshadow everything that complements our popping skin then that store got your back okay but yeah this is it for this video I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up and tell me in the comment section what you think of this my new creative it's not new but it's new to me okay i'm not always like this out of the box when it comes to like doing eyeshadow so tell me guys tell me what you guys think in the comment section of this eyeshadow look and of course i'll see you guys in my next before i forget guys don't forget to subscribe i don't know why i keep forgetting to say that to my videos don't forget to subscribe to my channel i see you go i see y'all my 1700 subscribers i love you all and i'll see you guys in my next video